we started Big Data Day LA as an opportunity to get developers and um, startup companies uh, a great way to get into a free conference as well as high quality and gives them an opportunity to learn what's happening in the big data and data science community. One of the great things about Big Data Days is, you know, normally they're free and driven by sponsors, so it allows a lot of people to come to a variety of events. I've been here doing Big Data in Los Angeles for 16 years. I've not seen an event as big as this. The facility itself is 26,000 square feet on two acres of land and had about, probably about a thousand people walk through the space. It's 9 a.m. on a Saturday morning and you're here. So can I get a round of applause for all of you? I think there's profoundly exciting opportunities for the way to use data generally, right? But I think in particular, there's a really exciting opportunity to use data for public life. I get a much better understanding of what people are trying to do, right? I sit in my office all day, my job is to solve problems, make this stuff better, but I don't always know how people want to use it. So one of the big things for me is just understanding how people want to use these tools, what problems they're trying to solve, and basically what they need from us. So Big Data at ALA has several open source community, um, anything from like LAMPSAP developers all the way to data scientists, um, data engineers, Hadoop. Um, Cassandra, all these, all these specific technologies have particular user groups that have anywhere from 200 to even 2,000 uh, members. It's an opportunity for, for the community to learn what the big corporate guys such as uh, Google, Netflix and um, Amazon are doing with big data and data science. It's also an opportunity to learn more about the new companies that are out there doing innovative stuff with big data and data science. Lunch is going to be catered and some of the main speakers, some of the keynote speakers are going to have, they're going to be sitting next to you having lunch, right? So this is a really wonderful opportunity for you to actually sit in front of somebody and actually, you know, pick their brain and figure out like why, why they're doing what they're doing. For a free event, there's a lot of swag. Um, lots of vendors are giving out t-shirts, um, pens, but you actually get to talk to people in depth and I think that's very, very valuable. This happening local and free, I mean, this cannot even beat it. This is, this is great. I find the vibe of it is, is a bit different. Driven by community members, it's organized by them, and people feel this different sort of community to it. 